Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a slightly different topic, slightly different video. So let's get into it. So today we're going to be discussing my May fave because I've kind of bought a new things, used a few new products and just done things a bit differently recently. So I just wanted to share my favourites with you guys and update you guys on what I've been using pretty much. So number one is the Moroccan Argan Oil and it's the heat defence spray that I did tell you guys about on my hair episode 11 and I've literally been using this religiously every day just spraying it on my hair even if I don't even if I don't straighten my hair, even if it's like literally not working against heat defense, I've literally been using it just because I love the scent. And I just literally, I just literally love the spray because it leaves my hair feeling really soft. So number two, we have the Primark PS Love Perfume. Guys, this smells freaking amazing. And I've literally been using it daily. As you can see, it is literally nearly empty. I think this was like four or five years something like that it was super affordable but you guys literally I love this so much like next time I go I'm definitely gonna try and pick a couple up just because I don't want them to like run out on me you know like I would literally I don't know what I would do if I could not smell like this again so for number three we have my relaxing time and I use these cucumber pan so I literally use these when I've had like a really hard day or a really stressful day or I'm just like really tired because I've been like working out or doing my running or my yoga and I'm just like sore everywhere or just just want a kind of spa night in so I've been using these on my eyes while I put my cream on my face and just I just pack myself with these and they're amazing because they're cooling pads and they make me feel like I'm cooling. Number four for today's video, we have the Dove Intensive Hand Cream. And I literally use this religiously every single night because I love the scent, I love the feeling, it leaves my hands super moisturized. I get complimented on how smooth my skin is, and I get asked a lot about my skincare products and what I do as a routine, which I will be uploading at some point a video for you guys. I've been asked a few times, like, how I keep my skin so perfect or how my skin so baby smooth and I will be sharing that with you guys this is in one of my scare routine, scare routines? skincare routines and this is what keeps my hands so soft you guys so for number 5 today's video I am gonna show you guys a new eye palette that I've been using religiously lately and you probably realized on my last couple of videos that I've not been using the Flora palettes and I've been using the Technique palettes. So I have a couple of Technique palettes and some that I still haven't used or shown you guys or even done a tutorial on yet just because they're literally so pretty. I literally don't want to like smudge anything. Like I do not want to breathe. I'm on the it. kind of person that when I buy an eye palette, I just don't want to breathe on it because it is so pretty. This is the palette I've been using guys and I'm going to open it just so you can't see the sun reflection and you can see the shades properly. So literally you guys, I've had my favorite shades on this palette and I'm gonna explain to you guys which ones they are. So one of my favorite shimmer shades is this one here just because I think it's really pretty and it gives like the eye a highlighter kind of look and I really really like that. So the next shimmer I've been using religiously is the gold one there. So as for the matte shades I've been using this nude. I've also been using the yellow and these two like warmer nudes here. I've used these blues or turquoise kind of greens in my last video you guys on my cover recreation makeup tutorial and i've literally been loving this palette so freaking much and i am it's literally my current may obsession so this is my may fave palette guys most of you that already know my nighttime routine which i previously posted on instagram quite a while ago so I should probably update you guys but you guys know or most of you know that I don't really use wipes on my face because I find it like or used to find it a little bit like a lazy makeup remover option and I just used to feel like it was kind of like the lazy option and it wasn't really looking after my 
like skin or anything like that or moisturizing it or just helping my skin whatsoever so I've kind of gone backwards on that but also updating you guys in my next video or at some point with my new skincare routine I've been using the Morrison's facial cleansing wipes for sensitive skin with pro vitamin B5 and aloe vera they bring 25 wipes and I've literally been all obsessed with these guys because it's just so easy to use like I do use a lot of cleansing creams and milks and stuff like that and like tonic waters and stuff like that to remove my makeup and I do still do it that is part of my everyday routine I do use the wipes before I use my creams and tonic removers and just stuff like that just because I find it so much easier to get rid of like everything first and then go in for a really good cleanse afterwards so I've been literally obsessed with these aloe vera wipes so my next monthly obsession is the Floma Slim Mascara. You guys, most of you guys know I used to work in Floma. I don't work in Floma anymore and I am still obsessed with a lot of their products because they are really good guys. Like I used to be a complete MAC user before and I'm not dissing MAC at all. Like I genuinely love MAC. The lipstick I'm wearing is MAC. I'm not dissing any makeup cosmetics or like brands in this video. I'm literally just letting you guys, updating you guys with my new monthly faves just to let you guys know kind of what I'm using and little bits and bobs that changed during the month. When I worked in Floma, I literally never tried this once like and I worked there for almost a year and I never just they didn't like I'll open it and show you guys like it just didn't look very appealing to me I normally go for really thick brushes like volume kind of brushes and I literally had a day off where I just wanted to use like complete new stuff on my face and I go through phases sometimes where I'm just like so sick of the same facial routines that I just literally change everything up. So I used this mascara and oh my freaking god I was like <laughs> monthly obsession slash fave you guys is literally my notebook because they are literally my freaking like you guys like there are so many things in a day that I want to do I'm like the kind of person that literally aspires to do everything all at once and that kind of that kind of crushes because I want to do a lot so every time I want to do so much I end up doing nothing just because the day kind of keeps ahead of me and as the day goes by I just get really tired and I haven't prioritized the things that I really wanted to so by literally journaling writing my feelings down writing my to-do list on a daily basis on a weekly basis including for YouTube stuff or personal stuff or even just how I feel about the day or what I've been up to it literally helps tons like I've been doing so much more now that I've been like writing my thoughts and kind of my to-do list stuff it's literally organized my entire life last but not least I am going to show you guys which you guys already know if you've been watching my latest video my current obsessed favorite highlighter palette at the moment and that is going to be the mega glow technique highlighter with these shades you guys i love this highlighter palette so much like no highlighter that cost three pounds can be that good but when i used it on one of my videos i was literally taken by just how affordable it is and how freaking good it is i'm wearing this highlighter right now guys by the way in these two shades and i love this highlighter so much you guys like i'm not trying to like get you guys to buy this highlighter by any means or is this video even sponsored i'll tell you guys that this highlighter i grabbed for literally three pounds and it is one of the best highlighters i have ever used in my life guys i really hope that you enjoyed this video it's a little bit different the kind of content that i normally upload just because i normally upload like tutorials or like little vlogs or updates or just hair stuff but i really wanted to let you know like guys know what I'm using on a day-to-day -day basis just because that changes on a weekly and even monthly basis sometimes and there's so many products out there that not a lot of you use or even I use that I probably don't even know about and I like kind of knowing what people's faves are and stuff like that on cosmetics or creams or anything that's like 
lifestyle related. So you guys, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. And I really hope that I've gone into detail with kind of everything because I hope I haven't left any bits out for you guys. You guys Thank you so much for watching this video. Let me know any feedback you have or questions or literally anything you guys think down in the comment section because I literally love knowing what you guys think. So if you like this video guys, leave it a big thumbs up. So for more videos, content and updates guys, hit that big red subscribe button. So guys, thanks again for watching this video. I love you guys so much to the moon and back and see you in my next videos. Bye.